Today we are joined by Mr. Sam Cherian, founder and managing director of Chevron Laboratories. Good evening, Mr. Sam, and welcome to the show. Good evening, Neha. Thank you very much for coming. First of all, I would like to start it with the very first question. The word Chevron has got volume in its name. So, how these words got implanted that defines your name and fame? Chevron is synonymous. Chevron talks about cleaning and hygiene in the country. I started this business uh, thinking the need of the cleaning situation in the country and I thought about Swachh Bharat 30 years back and I started with a plan to provide the, the right kind of cleaning services to improve the hygiene and cleaning standards in the country and I'm sure that I've done a great job and I'm, I'm successful in my initiative and the country, uh, the current Prime Minister, Prime Minister Modi, Modiji has taken it very seriously and he, what I thought today he is practicing it in the country. Mr. Cherian, the journey must be challenging. So what are the major obstacles you faced? How you overcome them? And what are the major milestones achieved in the last few years? From the con conceiving of the idea of starting an industry till its implementation, the hurdles were unimaginable. I can't really mention the hur hurdles because there's too many. But with my perseverance, consistency in my thinking and tenacity, I could overcome and made it made it to happen. I made it to happen. The, the success was basically because I was highly focused and realized that India needs this kind of uh, products and that was the motivating factor in my thinking. I achieved quite a lot of things in the last few years. The major thing I the, achieved was the ISO 9000 in the year 2000. Then I went on to upgrading on that, and then we realized that we need to have a research center to back up the business, set up a research center. We had a lot of scientists working, and they have decided to support us, and that was the outcome of the research center. Then we have had the appreciation from the Ministry of, Science, Ministry of Small Scale Industries as the 100 SMEs, and then we got an award as the 100 small giants in the country. Mr. Cherian, one can find range in diversification of products. So what are the major products and solutions offered by Chevron? We started with five products way back uh, in the year 1990. And when we went around into the market, we realized that the complexities in cleaning is quite different what we thought. Because we didn't have any benchmark when we started it. So we came back and realized that we need to develop products for the Indian dirt. We developed up to 100 products in the recent past. Then we realized that water is a scarce item in the country and getting into more trouble. We have developed products to use lesser water in cleaning and thereby the residual impact also is less, which resulted to protect the environment. I feel so proud that I have developed products which reduces the water consumption and at the same time protecting the environment, number one. Number two is that we realized that we have to produce super concentrates. We developed over eight to 10 products, which are called bold series, that are super concentrate. It can be diluted to one is to 200, 300 times, so that the logistic cost is less, the, the carbon emission is less in logistics, and uh, the water consumption at the usage is much less. So overall, an impact is created to save the environment. That is the achievement what we could do or what we have achieved in the past years. Then we realized that the hygiene conditions are so bad in the country, epidemics, pandemic situations are coming in. We develop products to deal with all the bacteria and viruses in the country, which is creating havoc after rain. That have been a great success. Then we realized that we need to be at par with the international companies who manufactures chemicals under the green seal standards. We are the first one to produce the Green Seal standard products in the country and it is growing rapidly. And I'm so proud to say that we have put serious effort towards that and I'm proud that the research center of what we have set up is contributing towards that. Your products are doing the job of cleaning the dirt with your eco-friendly items. So what motivated you or encouraged you to take this idea forward? I like cleaning and hygiene uh, 
ever since I started working uh, with international companies. And I realized that India is a country which is growing, a highly intellectual country. To have a good workplace, it's very important that I thought I should contribute towards that. Then I realized that we need to have the right kind of product. So we started developing the right kind of products and the need of a good hygiene situation is that one which motivated me to start this venture in the country when the country was not ready to do that. And it's successful. Today a good work environment is more important to have better productivity. And we are able to contribute towards that. That's where we are today. Mr. Prabhu, the production process is completely automated and sees no human intervention. So how this process is giving an edge to your products? See, automation is the order of the day. With automation, you get the efficiency, effectiveness and ease of doing the operations. That is how the Chevron, uh, from starting, it had a vision of automation and our MD was at it. So we have completely automated the entire filling operations and the entire uh, the thing which, are, which runs with minimum human intervention. You can see the entire email, filling, labeling, capping, sealing operations being done in an automated way. Now, we have not stopped at that. We have gone into the next step of digitalization. The entire process of our work from order to cash has been digitalized. With the digitalization, what happens is that you have uh, all the process has been digitalized and the uh, log sheets are being entered through tab. The operator goes and enters the variables of the uh, different process through the log sheet and it, uh, enter, he enters through the tab which gets into the system. With digitalization, digitalization we have got very good uh, results, uh, less paperwork, ease and most important thing is it gives good management information system which enables the management to take appropriate decision. So may I know how you plan your production process and maintain the quality of your products? See planning is a very important task for production. There we maintain the uh, production uh, uh, stock level at a minimum stock level uh, as well as the for the high moving as the high volume product. As soon as we get the orders, that gets executed. The vents which are custom made will be one which takes time and we uh, depend on the orders. That is how the planning process takes place. And with regard to quality, we are ISO 9001 2015 certified company. We ensure that quality is there throughout at all stages. We from the process of evaluation of the suppliers to the uh, receiving of materials, the process, the uh, on the line, all these uh, stages we have our independent quality checks. Also, uh, the main important and the end, even during dispatch, we make a random check. The team is made during the meetings motivated, kept motivated so that they are aware of quality and ensure that quality is taken care throughout. Mr. Chariot, please share the USP of your products to save the environment. Our products are environment friendly and we produce our products with environment friendly raw materials. The residual impact on our finished product is much less, rather negligible, thereby the usage of water is reduced and thereby the, 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 uh, that's how we save the environment. That's our USP. Mr. Cherian, it's great to say that you are building nation and saving children through your CSR activities. So please tell us about that. We are concerned about what's going around us. We thought it is better that we support the children who are in need, basically who have gone through difficult situations and children who have got congenital diseases. We support that particular situations and we have done almost 300 cases and we have the support from the Rotary and that is a great contribution. I feel that we as a company, we as a community doing that. And further, we have realized that hygiene situation in the, the schools, the young children are coming, they don't know how to brush, they don't know how to wash. We are supporting them with a kit which contains a toothbrush and a paste, soap, hand soap, and uh, give them a hygiene classes. And my team goes there and train them on how to inculcate that in their day-to-day -day living. We have been doing that for the last two years around six, three schools in Mysore city. And we realize that there is a large community, large number of people who are towards their fag end of their life with the terminal diseases and we support them 
through different agencies in and around Mysore. Dr. Shankar, I can see over 100 products and I'm sure it requires consistent technology upgradation. So please tell how you do that. Yeah, we keep upgrading our products uh, with, uh, at, at regular intervals. Uh, we have a three-pronged approach uh, to, to develop our products. Number one is uh, the continuous improvement. Uh, this is very important for any manufacturing industry. And we keep improving uh, our products uh, uh, continuously by minimizing the ingredients or adding new ingredients uh, for the existing uh, formulations, uh, whereby the load on the environment will be reduced and water consumption will, be, will also be reduced, which will become more eco-friendly. And second one is developing the products uh, for uh, customer needs. A customer will come to us and, uh, with a particular problem and we develop a product for their needs their requirement, uh, we give a solution to them. This is the second one. And third one is adding novel products into the list. Uh, here we focus on replacing synthetic uh, ingredients with uh, the natural ones. So this will make the products more eco-friendly. And in addition, uh, novel products will be developed to improve cleanliness and hygiene level in our daily life. Uh, at an affordable cost without compromising on the quality. And our focus is always on two national objectives. One is Swachh uh, Bharat Abhiyan, and second one is Make in India. We are always inspired by these two uh, objectives, national objectives, and over a period of uh, three decades, we have developed more than 100 products, uh, and uh, we are successful in meeting the requirement of all our customers. Shaila, I understand you have customers across the country. So I would like to ask how do you offer your best services in retention and servicing of your customers? Yes, Neha, we have almost 1,000 clients all over India like TCS, Cap Germany, Cognizance, IBM. And we have a strong support, customer support team who supports me in executing the orders. Uh, we track every order that comes to us and make sure till it reaches the client. And once it reaches the client, we have a training team headed by Mr. Jeevan who takes care of training to all this unit and make sure that all the products are being utilized in a very best manner. So, and all the customer claims which are complaints which come to us, we make sure that it has been attended and uh, a good result has been provided to the client. Madam, one can see your involvement since the day you landed in Mysore and I'm sure that the reins of Chevron will be passed on to your children. So how far do you see the next generation climbing the ladder of success few years down the line? Yes, my children, my son and my daughter both grew up along with Chevron. They have seen the steady growth of Chevron and I'm sure they will want to take it to a greater height. The sky is the limit for this particular industry. Now the younger generation being more innovative, more energetic, more creative, I'm sure they will be able to take it to a greater height. Uh, there is uh, no limit to it because the plant is already automated, digitized, so the interest is more for the children to take it forward. I'm sure they'll be able to take it to greater heights uh, beyond what we all can think of because of their interest. The earth is inching towards becoming a desert, but companies like Chevron are putting their efforts to convert it back to forest. Chevron sets an example how chemical solutions can cater to client needs in an eco-friendly manner. So let's join hands and flourish the idea. Go green to keep the earth clean.